Welcome back to Maury's Music. We're getting that much closer to the new NAMM show, just a few days away. And just as promised, Martin's giving us one brand new model every single day along the way. Today is no exception, and the big reveal is the DSS 15 Streetmaster, a sloped shoulder guitar at a very affordable price. Let's check in with our friend Spoon Phillips and see what he's up to if he has any comments on this new sloped shoulder dreadnought model. Hello, Maury. Happy Monday. We didn't get the snow you guys got in Pennsylvania, but it's certainly chilly out here in Brooklyn. What are you doing out in the cold? <laughs> well, <clears throat> being a bona fide degreed master of fine arts, I thought I would try something a little creative and do this one from the street. Huh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Does this mean you're psyched for the new DSS 15 Streetmaster? Yes, indeed. This is a full-sized dreadnought model with sloped shoulders in the 15M series of solid wood Martin guitars that have solid mahogany for the back and the sides and the top, which helps it have that unique mellow tone that is both woody and pretty. This new sloped shoulder dreadnought has the special Streetmaster treatment, giving it the look and appearance of a well-worn veteran instrument, but with the brand new playability and lifetime warranty of a brand new guitar. Yes, indeed, and I think it's more than just a, a worn or weathered look. I think it's uh, very artistically done. And uh, this extra large slope shoulder dreadnought size really gives it the the surface area to show off that cool Streetmaster finish because it's a larger sound chamber with a larger top and back and longer sides than the other 14 fret square shouldered dreadnought in the 15 series and the slope shoulder design of this model should give it a larger deeper voice whether the player is just learning their first basic chords or is already a true guitar master. And the word on the street is people like these uh, street master guitars an awful lot. I've seen them in, in uh, cafes and pubs here in New York City at open mics and gig nights uh, for some years now. And they, they really look really good under stage light, multicolored stage light, red, green, yellow. It, it uh, reflects the light uh, differently depending on how light or dark the area of the finish is thanks to that street master technique. As you know, Spoon, Martin invented the 12 fret slope shoulder back in 1916 and they started making 14 fret slope shoulder dreads in 2002 as special editions. But this 2019 D slope shoulder design, DSS 15 Streetmaster, is the most affordable slope shoulder guitar Martin has ever brought to production. Yes, the most affordable slope shoulder dreadnought for certain uh, thus far, and uh, in an all solid wood Martin guitar, uh, wooden fretboard, wooden bridge. Um, and lightly braced to compensate for that hard wood top. And uh, in general, the 15 series are popular not just for the price, but also for the tone. I have a friend who is a columnist uh, and writes for um, Fretboard Journal and for Acoustic Guitar Magazine, among others. And her favorite Martin guitar is a modern era 0015. Her best friend was a respected guitar teacher here in New York City until she was lured away by her uh, her alma mater, the Berklee School of Music in Boston, and uh, she also plays a 0015. But 15 series are popular uh, among the music industry in all varying sizes. Uh, the other Chris Martin, the lead singer for uh, Coldplay, plays a square-shouldered D15. Eddie Vedder and Leo Kotke both own and and uh, times play a uh, triple O 15S. So you're going to find uh, 
you're going to find people all over that really like these 15 series. And now we have the new DSS 15 amp Streetmaster that has a very comfortable modified low oval profile on its 1 and 11 16 inch neck, uh, similar to the neck that's on the square shouldered dreadnought. So I, a lot of guitar for the money, a lot of Martin Tone for the money, and now in this really cool slope shoulder Streetmaster model. And I, I think I'm going to have to sign off now because it's awfully cold out here. <laughs> okay, my friend, thank you for taking it to the street for a very masterful assessment of another very cool Martin guitar. Yes, indeed. I look forward to catching up with you with the next Martin Reveal video from someplace a little warmer. And thank you for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.